Hello, hola, bonjour, ni hao, konnichiwa, namaste, marhaba, shalom, shin chao. My name is Sunny and today I would like to share my experience about Casaloma, Toronto. Let's start with a little bit of history first. Casaloma itself, uh, the word itself is originated from Spanish. That means hill house or house on the hill. But to be honest, the one that suits better would be castle on the hill. But I can do better with the jokes. Uh, but to the contrary to its location, Castleoma is in Midtown Toronto. That's not the part of the Toronto that has all the hill stuff. Original built of Castleoma started in 1911, and it took three years to finish this magnificent piece of history. In addition to that, it costed 3.5 million dollars, and which, as per today's economy, is going to be 91.9 million Canadian dollars. Wow. So you must be thinking, so much money was spent. So it has to be the city of Toronto or government of Canada. But actually, it was a big financer by the name of Sir Henry Pallet, who was responsible for the construction of such a magnificent building, with the help of the architects Edward James Lennox, who later got responsible for uh, building more places in Toronto, like Old City Hall and much more. Now the question arises: Who was Sir Henry Pallet, and how he was able to afford all this? Well, Sir Henry Pallet was born in a British family in Kingston, Ontario. He was known to be a passionate romantic and a lover of military, especially Queen's Rifle. That can easily easily be witnessed when you actually go to Castle Loma, especially on the third floor. There's a full-fledged museum just on Queen's Rifle. In those days, Sir Henry Pallet is known to own an airline manufacturing company, a stock brokerage firm. He also served the military, and God knows what more. But these days, Casa is owned by City of Toronto, who not just takes care of 650,000 visitors a year, but also hosts 250 private events, which also includes movies, films, marriages, photo shoots, and some of the blockbusters movie like X Men were shot in it. 